There are eight common types of machining processes which can be used in Mazatrol programs. Other processes are available on machines with C-axis capability, which allow cross-drilling or cross-milling. The first two machining processes are the bar turning and copy turning processes. They are abbreviated as BAR and CPY. BAR and copy turn processes are used for basic turning operations, including OD, ID, and turning on the face. Sequences can be programmed to cut straight line features, tapers, and contours. Using these basic shapes as building blocks, the sequences within a process define the final profile of that portion of the workpiece to be machined by the tool selected. The finished dimensions of the features to be machined are given within coordinates and other sequence data. Depending on the shape, there may be start point coordinates, final point coordinates, angles or radii, and corner values. The only difference between bar and copy processes is the path the tool takes. A bar process gradually forms the profile as the tool makes successive passes. This continues until the tool reaches the program shape as specified in the sequence data. However, with copy turning, the tool follows the shape of the feature on each pass. Copy turning is used for pre-shaped pieces, such as castings. The tool cuts deeper, following the programmed profile on each pass, until it reaches the final depth. Many processes in a Mazatrol program have only one line of sequence data, such as this edge process. The only processes which can have more than one sequence line are bar and copy processes, threading processes, and manual machining processes. At times, the corners of features may not be fully machined by the turning processes, as you see for this OD groove. This is usually caused by the angle of the cutting tool. Corner processes, abbreviated as CNR, are used to clean up these incomplete corners. 